we really have to go. Our driver is waiting for us. Ooh, watch your head. Okay. We are here with Priyankara, yeah. <laughs> he has the coolest sunglasses. <laughs> and of course, we don't forget Mali. Hi! <laughs> wow, and now we are very excited to go to Sigiriya. All right. Okay, yeah. I don't know if you can see this huge Hindu temple, very old one. So we stopped for a coconut. Opa! Woohoo! That's nice! Awesome. Oh, I can feel my legs again. It's great. That's one coconut. No, no, no. no, you, you, you. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> I was just wondering to take it. Nice. So we are on the road between Dambula and Sigiriya. That's you taking a sip and enjoying. Wow. <laughs> so we just got offered help by this truck mm. to take us because we're on an unknown road. Google Maps put us on an unknown road. Okay. Just a few more minutes to the hotel and we have wait. <laughs> So uh, chill compared to Candy, we just came from Candy. Hey, we're here in Sigiriya. Woohoo! Nature Park Villa. And look at this. Look at this. We actually saw an elephant on the way here. The closest we've seen an elephant yet. So Sigiriya, I have very high expectations for the nature and everything. And here's Mali drinking. Hmm. What is, is papaya. it? Papaya? Papaya yeah. juice. Papaya? Mm, good. Mm. 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 Cheers. Cheers. Papaya juice, very good. We're headed now to the room. They're helping with the suitcase. We got the other bags. And now we get to see the room. And we're excited because this place is like really beautiful. Oh, an air condition, an elephant pillow, and a nice big room, and a desk so I can sit down and work. Mali is walking down the steps of our really amazing new home for the next few days. We have elephant statues everywhere. It's beautiful part of the hotel and it's hot in Sigiriya so it's a good thing we have a room with a pool it's a pool with a view and they are building some construction behind us wow this is a real jungle pool nature all around so we're here in beautiful Sigiriya but i want to talk to you about something and this also is for sri lanka people business owners watching this in tourist places don't jump on our heads like we're wallets i'm asking you nice it's not every place but sometimes you just pass by a place and they try and get everything out of you and make you feel like you need to sit somewhere you need to eat here, even though the prices are super tourist and expensive. You don't have to do this. The best way to get a customer is to treat him with respect. And let the customer do what he wants to do. Not make him feel uncomfortable with like, like this. Okay? And for tourists, if you ever feel uncomfortable somewhere or like you've been dragged into some kind of tourist trap be firm and say no thank you and turn around and leave you don't have to do anything that you don't want to do okay my body my choice baby you know what i mean 
Hello. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting used to talking to myself on the camera. It may look funny. I barely have any battery, but I found this really cool uh, auto mechanic shop. Look, they build the thing from concrete. Usually, uh, we have this machine that lifts the car. Here, you drive the car up, and there's a place to lie down and do the mechanic work. That's very cool. It's very creative. I've never seen this use. Nice. So now we eat. We're very hungry. We don't eat breakfast today. Okay, we're gonna dig in and we we'll see you soon. We will show you some cool stuff in Sigiria. Boom! Wow. This is the open savanna. I just found a peahen, a male peacock. And you can see here, this is a tree house for elephant watching. Because yes, elephants can come right up to the hotel and you have to be careful. This is the wild nature. That's beautiful. And if you heard that gunshot, Maybe it was someone trying to scare off an elephant or something because they're always keeping watch that the elephants don't come and ruin the crops. Here you can see another house for watching for the elephants and I kind of found a way to step into the middle of this field. I'm not sure if they're growing this on purpose, this leaf, but it looks like a field. And it looks like there's some kind of uh, natural irrigation system with this stream running through this field. And I'm walking on this, uh, opa, I see some stuff in the bushes. No crocodiles for me. I don't want to be crocodile dinner. I'm too young, baby. But being young means I'm tasty, so... Oh no. That's now two months finish. Two months finish? Yes. Uh, so I'm just discovering that this is rice. You see? This Let's see. This. Oh, that's the rice. Yeah, that's... Oh, wow. I've never seen this. This is a rice patty. Yes. This is I rice. had a feeling it was food. I show you close up. This is the way the rice is growing. You can see it's even here some white rice, some natural rice. Wow, look at the color of the sky. Sometimes the peacock sounds like a cat. He makes meow. Meow! <laughs> Sometimes it's like, Yahoo! Wow, very cool. So apparently the elephants, they come mostly in the night time. And there are guards sitting in the towers, like the guy I was just walking with. And they have rifles, but they don't shoot the elephants. They just make a big sound, like an old rifle that makes a big sound. And they hope the elephants will run away. And now we have some kids here enjoying the pool. Of course, nothing like jumping in the pool when you're a kid, huh? But even now it's uh, so much fun. Tomorrow I think we go. Musical bike. Hi. So we ate at a place called Millie's restaurant. I can't really recommend it. We weren't feeling too well afterwards. So now we're just eating at our hotel. And this food looks on a whole nother level. Good morning from Nature Park Villa, Siberia. And I'm not awake, so I have these sunglasses so you can see how tired I am. And Mari just peeled me out of bed in the middle of a dream. But yeah, it's I'm sorry. No, no, it's good because because we would have missed this breakfast. Look, we have donuts. 
all kinds of stuff. It looks it, really it good. It looks like a meal in a fancy summer camp. <laughs> <laughs> so far I'm really enjoying this. And my theory is they give it in a tray because if an elephant comes, then it's really easy to just pick up the breakfast and run away with it. <laughs> and, then, and then you can continue eating somewhere else. Guys, we're going for a hike and I'm trying to tell Mali it's already 10.30 and we should get going but she has to, of course of course you need I to want... look fabulous to climb on a mountain it's like the Met Gala Hey! hey. Oh hour of hair and makeup to go hiking it makes sense and an now hour, I'm glam and glow an hour of hair and makeup to go climb a rock and then come back to the hotel and jump into the pool you need all makes perfect sense fabulous. to me He's this is just jealous of me <laughs> look I have no hair and makeup and I'm, because I'm glam and I'm glowing but you are also there's almost no difference. I mean, there's difference, but... Okay, so we're on the tuk-tuk on the way to Pidurangala. We have our nature park villa tuk-tuk, and we're gonna see you very soon at Pidurangala Rock. I wanted to film before on the way. I saw these elephants, but now I get another chance to show you. There are fences made of hand-painted elephants and it's so nice so we paid 1000 rupee for the entrance compared to uh, Sigiriya rock, lion rock it's 11,600 so I really recommend if you're on a budget come to Pidurangala it's probably more beautiful that's what everyone say and you can save a lot and now I show you Ooh you think I can ring this bell? Probably not this is the temple and now we're gonna climb and we were told be careful the last part is hard I actually had a dream about it last night uh, because I knew this before so I had this dream that some people were falling but I'm sure it's not that difficult that way? and now we're gonna find the way up we have one we have two so I guess I guess it's this way okay we're here with Mali the professional hiker Ten-time Olympic hiking world champion, eleven-time gold medal European hiking champion. <laughs> These steps are huge. Yeah. Oh, Mali, the professional hiker, with some insight on the step size. Oh wow! These are getting very. These are getting very serious. Nice. Hello. Hello. Wow. So it's a beautiful time to hike. And some great weather too. Alright. So we keep climbing the ancient steps to the temple and uh, I just wanted to add one more thing the guy who sold us tickets he said all the money is going to help the temple and the poor people and Sigiriya rock like lion rock it's really a business and uh, yeah it's 11 times 
more expensive and uh, I have a drone so once I get to the top of Piturangala I'm gonna go visit Lion Rock with my drone for free <laughs> and here we have our professional hiker Mali go Mali go Mali It's hard? It's hard, but you can do it. It's hard, but you can do it. This nice. is the way to be professional hiker. Definitely. Let's see how much we have left. It's a beautiful hike in the meanwhile. Through this forest and these rocks. And it's shade. So it's no problem that we started the hike uh, at like 11 maybe 15 to 11 okay unless something really drastic changes in the view see you at the top Mali show us your muscles yeah okay we're about to finish the first stage of this hike the hike is uh broken into two stages the first stage has the steps like you've seen the second stage we actually have to do some climbing and i think we're just arriving now to our first viewpoint after we see the buddha statue oh i found the buddha statue wow you're gonna see it in one second if you continue walking okay. look at this look at this 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 is Buddha entering Nirvana and the statue, they have it in a few places. Uh, it's also the Dambula rock cave temple and in Polonarua. It's one of the positions they build the Buddha statue. Wow, it's huge. It's at least like 10 meters or something. Amazing. Look. Enjoy. Wow. Let's see. So someone is praying here. I've been quiet. We have our first amazing view. I'm not sure how this is possible, but there's this little pond with a lot of fish in seemingly the most random place for a pond on top of a mountain. Sri Lanka, you continue to amaze me. So I'm guessing this is the difficult part of the hike where you have to start deciding your own path and ducking under branches and stuff. Uh-oh, I think like we already made some kind of wrong decision. Okay, I can. I need to put down my GoPro for this probably, uh, and and do this carefully. Okay. 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 Yeah, okay. Now step up. <laughs> yeah, just stay low. <laughs> What's going on with Mali? <laughs> okay, Hamudu, I'm not going to go with Ah, okay. <laughs> so you want me to go more up? So we can send here one sec? Yes, yes. So wait, let me... Okay, I'm just sitting here. Safely. Okay. <sighs> Okay, and now... Okay, hand. Hand. Ah. Now go, go. Go. Oh, Just go, I'm holding you, I got Ay. you. I'm pushing you, okay. Ay. It's Ay. so hard to be professional. <laughs> <laughs> Mali, Mali almost started crying. <laughs> Uh, yeah, be careful, be careful. Yeah, nice. It's hard, but it's so fun, so much fun. 
Just I want you to be very, very careful. Okay. Because I love you. Okay. And I don't feel like going oh, to hospital in Sri Lanka. Yeah. Okay. This yeah, wait, let me help you also with this, this one. Right. Okay. Let me help you one second. Okay. Yeah, get low. Do that one. And now come through here. We got this, guys. We got this. Okay. Yeah. Uh, if you weigh over 200 kilos, I would recommend... Uh, uh, not going on this hike. You can just watch it on YouTube. Okay, now we have another little challenge. Making sure this is stable. Good. Okay, I'm gonna have to help Mali with this one too. Okay. Hand. Hand. You okay? You got it. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Hi. You okay? Good. We continue. We continue. We continue. Nice. So this is the hardest part of the climb. Here, Mali. I will show you how to pass this part. Yeah. Okay. Oh. What a man! Okay, now I come and help you. Yeah, sorry, we're talking Hebrew because uh, things are getting serious. So we're communicating in the native language. Nice, Mali. Okay, let's turn this off for a second and get up to here. We have to go through this. Oh, I see Lion Rock. Hey, Mali's got this. Nice. We told you she was 11 time European uh, hiking champion. And we weren't lying, guys. Look at this. Woohoo! Guys, we did it. Lion Rock. And I'm gonna film it with my camera so you can see a better view also. And I'm gonna do some drone shots. We did yes. it! Yes! Woohoo! Yeah! Wow. Alright, and we have some monkeys up here, we have some dogs up here. Wow, what a view. Look at this huge Buddha statue over there. Huge Buddha. You see? White Buddha. Ah. Huge one. Yes. The one who's standing. Yes, wow, this is beautiful. And the hike makes it even more worth it. Okay, we're gonna explore the top. We have some very tired people here. Uh, everyone's sweating. You can't do this hike without sweating, I promise you. Now we're hiking to the very, very top of Pidurangala. Wow, what a hike. What a cool hike. Just the perfect amount of extreme with the crazy payoff. This view. This view. Woohoo! That's a view. 360 360 view lakes oh man yeah, that was a fun this moment. is crazy we're gonna hang out here on top of the rock for a while take some photos explore Mali what do you have to say well it was hard but it was worth it. Worth it. Wow. Show us your muscles again. Yeah. I'm such a hiker. Strong girl. Wow. And you? I do this for breakfast, guys. <laughs> this is like nothing to me. But uh, just a fun little stroll in the park. I wish all parks were like this. And? Then I would have a lot of fun. I think 
very very good way to start your morning. Ah, there's no better way. Look, every side you go, there's some like lake. And we have clear, perfect weather. We can just see all the way to everywhere. This feels like top of the world. This feels like top of the world. Wow. And we get to see the beautiful rock from far. Instead of paying 12,000 rupee to climb the beautiful rock and then you don't get to see it because you're on it. Uh, so, use your brains. Yes, don't forget to bring water with you. Oh, don't it's forget to bring water. Important. It's very important. Yes, Mali is correct, 100%. We go down because it's very hot. Tell them what happened to us right okay. next to this tree. Let's do a reenactment. Let's come. Come here to the okay. tree and show us what happened. Me and John, we're like standing there, okay? And he uh, make a picture of me. With Mali's phone. Yes, with my and phone. Our and bags were right where these guys were sitting. Okay. You can see them. Hi, guys. Hi. <laughs> We left our bags right where they were sitting. Ah, you are Sri Lanka? Yes. We had a monkey attack right here, you remember? Yeah. So we are just telling about the monkey attack. So I was taking pictures of Mali right here. It was fine, but then uh, I think somebody tell us that the monkey is stole, taking, our stuff. taking our stuff from the open bag. And okay, we came to the bag and, and, and we see the monkey like taking the, um, the filters. Yeah, filters and rolling papers yes. for rolling tobacco. And then I just see him jumping on the tree with, with, the, filter. with the filters on, in his mouth. So, and then he started to open the... But you told them, you came to the monkey and you told them, uh, yes, after, please give me back no, the filter. Uh, okay, the monkey, I, I saw him like uh, open the roll paper <laughs> and throw it away. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> so I was like, please monkey, give me back the filters and uh, in a second, it was yes. a nightmare, so. he just was like, Aah. Okay, and now I, we are going to do a reenactment of how Mali almost uh, ran off of the mountain. So Mali, pretend to be the scary monkey, go ah. And now kill me, yes. I'm going to be you. <laughs> and this is how Mali almost died. <laughs> oh, thank you. We have an audience. Yes, yes. <laughs> okay. Now we go down from the mountain. Yes. Goodbye. So be, be careful. Bye, guys. Bye. Be careful. <laughs> yes. Be careful. So. Uh, we had a very interesting time on top of Apiturangala and uh, I just recommend don't uh, leave your bags open and your cameras out when you have uh, macaque monkeys around because these guys are uh, they're crazy crazy monkeys langur monkeys are very friendly and nice uh, they may also try and take your stuff but they are more afraid of you than you are of them but this macaque monkey he has teeth like teeth like big teeth wow. like you don't want to mess with this guy wow. and uh you also it don't you also don't want to run off the side of a mountain by accident yes don't be mali yeah <laughs> uh i hope my parents uh skip this part and also mali's parents okay we're gonna climb back down the mountain uh and see you soon we have now the hard part so a last uh, little view of Lion Rock. I show you some amazing drone footage, of course. Uh, Mali, come here. Yes, we made it. We made it. Thank you, Lion Rock. Thank you, Piturangala. Uh, really once in a lifetime experience. Yeah. So we just passed the hardest part of the hike on the way down. It's also the hardest part on the way up. Watch out for the crazy monkeys. Okay, I think ah. we, we're gonna let them. We're gonna let go. It's okay. So I just wanted to give you my number one hiking tip for climbing rocks. Just stay on your butt. As long as you can lean back and sit on your butt, 
You're gonna be okay. Don't lean forward. Sit on your butt. And do it slowly. Okay, on the way down, Mali says she's really happy she did this nice braid. Otherwise, the heat would have made the, her hair like stick to her back or something. I don't know. I don't have these problems. Uh, I don't have long hair. And we met this really nice family and we even took photo with them, with the drone. It's a husband, wife, grandpa, one kid and one sister's kid. Yes. But they're like brothers, they're two weeks apart. They're really sweet. They just were yelling, yay! They so help us. Yes, After they help the... us with the monkey. After what like my with the monkey. Yeah. <laughs> ah, it's the end of the hike. We got to the final stairs. We already covered up because we saw that it was becoming the temple again. So now we're going to sit here and take off our shoes to pass through the to pass through the temple ground. Wow, what an experience, huh? Amazing. Amazing and crazy. Right. We just finished the hike. This is the end. We're going to get some water. We only brought a small bottle so we would have an easier climb. Ah, yes. I love the sense of accomplishment you get when you finish like a really extreme hike. Especially when you get this amazing view like we had a Nine Arch Bridge, like we had Adam's Peak, Little Adam's Peak. And now we can also say we did Pidurangala. Maybe sometime I say Pidurangala, sometime Pidurangala. The right one is Pidurangala with D. Oh, I see monkeys. You and see monkeys don't. and now you're afraid? Yes, uh. I just don't look at them uh. and I hope they don't look at me. Uh. <laughs> uh. It's so nice to meet you guys, really. Thank you're a beautiful you. family. Thank you. Really. Yeah. These are our friends from the mountain. They really help us. Okay, now we look for some water. Driving back and look, Lion Rock. Lion Rock in the distance. Bye bye. Yeah, so we just got back to Nature Park Villa and we switched to our swimsuits. I mean, I'm in the same thing I was wearing before. We're going to the pool. Why not? Why not? We'll take advantage of the fact that we have our first hotel with a pool in Sri Lanka. It's gonna be so refreshing after this yes. crazy day. We will test the pool. We need to come a little bit. Now feel the water is really nice. Wow. Yes. Wow. Wow. Okay. Three, two, one. Yeah. Yeah. Refreshing. Now I can. It's a good pool. Wow. Can I stay here forever? No. <laughs> because it's, the night will in come. Sri Lanka. The night will come. Oh, that's almost, terrible. Almost, oh, food, food, food. So, like you heard before, Mali almost jumped off the mountain to escape the monkey, but it's not a very effective escape plan. Yes, I feel uh, unless uh, cool right now. luckily, nothing happened, everything's okay. Thank you, whoever was watching over us. God, yes. Buddha, thank you, thank you. Allah, thank you. Thank you for saving Mali. Yes, thank you. I wouldn't know what to do if something happened to Mali. I would go crazy. I would jump. I would either jump or maybe two, three days later. I'm not gonna do the symbol so I don't get banned from YouTube. We have to continue our life and find Yeah, a... luckily it's just a nice story, but seriously, be careful. If a monkey takes something from you, let it take the whatever it is. Don't 
start asking him for the whatever it is back. Just hope. Don't just yeah. Not nothing is worth your life. Not a camera. Not a telephone. Not filters. Not definitely. <laughs> not filters. Huh? Definitely. Good morning, Mali. Good morning. We have our first hopper. Mm -hmm. Somehow we never order hoppers the whole time we're here, but we just got some for breakfast. And we have we have shao shop. It's a drink. I'm not sure what it's made, but it's very tasty. We have this sweet uh, chocolate coconut pancake, hopper, sugar cookie, chocolate cake, fruits. Really nice breakfast. Like beer, it's it's have taste a little bit like beer. It oh. tastes like beer to you. Beer, a glass. Pear, 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 pear. 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 I thought you were saying beer. Beer and it tastes like no, a pe tastes a, a lot more like a pear than like beer. <laughs> pear. So today we are leaving Sigiriya probably, going to Dambula. After Dambula, probably Pinawala to see. Um, an elephant orphanage, but a real one. We don't want to go to one that's taking advantage of the elephants. It's very important to us, so we're going to do our research and go somewhere where they really treat the elephants with respect. No riding the elephants. It's not good for the animals. It's not respectful. I agree. So we don't mind to pay a little more, but to go somewhere that really cares about the animals. Um, so now we're going to eat our breakfast. It smells very good. And then get ready and continue on our journey. Okay. <laughs> Okie dokie. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.